Hey guys, so I know I'm not the only one who has this quarantine hair going on. I have let my girlfriend cut it, cut the sides a little bit, and then the back, but the top has been pretty much growing. I was able to get it trimmed a little bit the last time that barbershops and salons were open, but it's time for a real cut. So I'm going to get redo of my haircut and let's go. So came back, got a fresh cut. I didn't really do a lot of filming in the salon out of respect and privacy for the employees as well as the clients that go to the salon. But shout out to Edgar Scissorhands. Um, I've known him for just about 10 years and he's been cutting my hair for about six or seven years now. So I've been going to him for a long time. He knows exactly what I like. Every time I want to change a little bit of the style that I want my hair, if I want to color it, he always does an amazing job. So shout out to him. So I wanted to come back home and do a styling video. Um, I know I always wear my Dodger hat. You have to rep LA. Um, this is my all-time favorite hat. Uh, if you see me outside, I'm typically wearing my Dodger hat, but I wanted to do like a getting ready video, but simply just styling my hair. Uh, so as you can see, I got the sides cleaned up. I left the top a little squared off because I'm growing out the top. As you can see, I wanted to keep the sides closer to my part a little bit longer just to create a more even transition. I feel like when my hair is longer and I have more of a shorter side as well as a shorter transition, um, I'm not really feeling the look that I get with it. So Edgar always knows if I'm keeping it long to keep this part a little bit longer as well compared to the sides right here. So, all right, let's do my hair. All right, so this is freshly washed hair. Um, and I'm gonna blow dry it using just a regular pro beauty tools. I got this as a Christmas present um, a couple of years ago. So, my hair a little more. I like it to be really moist, really damp, um, so that the blow drying will actually help keep my hair in place. So I don't know if you guys can see, but it is super wet. Um, I just like it a little better. Um, I feel like the way that I style my hair, it stays better um, when the hair is really wet. So uh, the products that I use, I put this in a travel size container, but it is the Tresemme um, Heat Tamer, um, especially when you are drying your hair, you wanna protect it. So this is what I use. Spray it just kind of all over. Make sure that all of your hair is covered so that it is protected. And then after that, I use this argan oil, Ar argan, argan oil of Morocco um, by OGX. So that is one of the products that I have been using for a while. Um, I feel like it really gives um, this kind of like shimmer as well as it also protects your hair um, because whenever I style it, I do blow dry it. So it does protect my hair from the heat. 
Um, so I just use a, I don't know, brush. I don't know what kind of brush this is. Um, Denman, Denman. Um, it says made in the UK. Uh, it's just got these little bristles on it. I just like the way that it brushes my hair and combs my hair. Um, so first I just like to use kind of a hot, this doesn't get too hot, but I'll get, use the hot temperature and put it to, um, about a, a low to a medium, nothing too crazy. So I'm just creating, um, some height in my part um, because my hair is super straight and if I don't create that height it'll stay about this short. Um, I like it to have a little bit more height to it. So once you see it you know starting to get a little high, dry out a little bit. Um, it's not as wet anymore. With this longer area on the side, I just like to comb it back and blow dry at the same time, just so that it'll stay in place. And once I see it starting to stay up instead of that just hangover um i'll stop and then the last part is basically just to do the back um so everybody has this spiral in the back of their head um obviously when you have longer hair you can't see it but um, once i cut my hair i realized i had two of them so they definitely fight in the back of my head um who wants to win and where my hair is going apart. So in order to um, kind of just make it a cleaner look, I just like to brush in one direction, just the direction that my hair is going or that I want my hair to go. And I will blow dry it just until it stays in place and until the hair is dry. So that hair is pretty much dry and I'll just take a couple final minutes um, just to make sure that my entire head is dry and it's styled and kind of set in the place where I want it to go. So it's got a pretty good hold right now um, with just the heat tamer as well as the OGX. Um, but just for a little extra hold, if I'm going out or I literally just want it to stay like this, um, my go-to hair product is Redken Bruise. Um, I use the clay pomade. Um, It is maximum control, gritty finish. Um, I've used waxes before, I've used clays before, um, but this is the product that really doesn't have that greasy finish, um, but it has an amazing hole. It kind of has like a shiny, um, shiny yet kind of matted finish, which is really cool. Um, so it'll, I'll just rub it my hands, it'll kind of turn white or just clean, clear. So just run it through my hair. Make sure you get everywhere. I like to press down my part a little bit just so that any flyaways can 
settle down and there you go that is the final look um so for me i know that um with quarantine it can be hard um it's definitely not easy just to stay home and stay inside, um, not see family, not see friends. Uh, we have passed spring break, which is a huge deal for a lot of people. Summer break, which is a huge deal I know for a lot of families to kind of just get out and spend time together. Um, so your health, whether it's physical health or mental health is obviously important, um, especially during a time like now where we can't do everything that we love. Um, and so for me especially, I think um, taking care of your mental health is a huge deal. Um, and a big part of that is not only eating and um, drinking the things that I love with the people that I love, but also feeling comfortable in your own skin. So for me, that starts with um, my hair. I don't know if I'm the only one, but when I let my hair grow and it's kind of all over the place, um, you know, it doesn't really make me feel so great about myself. But when I get a clean cut and I have the time um, and the energy um, and kind of drive to do my hair, it definitely changes my mood and my kind of emotions about myself. Um, so definitely take care of your mental health, whether if that is to um, cook, clean, go outside, work out, um, spend time with friends and family, um, obviously at a socially safe distance. Um, so definitely take into consideration your health um, and your well-being and stay safe. Um, so as always, I hope you liked this video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!